Hello friends, and friends of friends, because let's be honest, we're all connected in one way, shape or form. You're in the right place if you want to make your own natural hairspray. In fact, this hairspray. Woo! This is really exciting. So quick story, for myself, my health has not been at its optimum point, so I've been doing all that I can to um, detoxify my environment. One of those things was looking into the ingredients list of just general products that I use. When I was looking into the back of my hairspray product, I found propane. Propane. Ridiculous. So that's why we're going to make our own natural hairspray using just ingredients that you can source from your kitchen and natural essential oils. Let's do this. What a beautiful morning. Let's crack on. So for this, you are going to need sugar an 8 ounce spray bottle with a, a light spritz top this is not one of those pulley ones it's just you just want a light spritz and you're going to need geranium essential oil lavender essential oil peppermint clary sage and rosemary water so one cup of water into your saucepan with four teaspoons of sugar you can try with salt if you would rather not use sugar then bring that mixture to the boil and mix that sugar in so it dissolves. I promise I'm not up to anything here, my black smoking cauldron. It was a cold day and then you could see the steam. And then bring that mixture to the boil and then once that's boiling, switch the heat off and remove the mixture to cool down before you use it later. You want to take the top off of your 8 ounce bottle. <laughs> Maybe give that a snip snip. We are going to do two drops of geranium, two drops of lavender, two drops of peppermint. Oh gosh, it's a rainbow of scents going on right now since these have all been open. Two drops of curry sage. Last one, two of rosemary. So the astute among you will have realised that that is two drops of each. And then it's as simple as just pouring in your boiled sugar water to blend in with the oil. Beautiful. And then you'll just sort your little nozzle out, cut it depending on where you want it to be. Just for now, I'm going to put it in like this. Give it a shake. Give it a spritz. <laughs> there it is. Mmm. <laughs> It actually smells really good. So there you have it. You have made your own spray. <laughs> Boom! <laughs> See you next time. Bye bye.